Hey, how's it going? Today I'll show you how you can jailbreak your Google Chromecast, Google TV or any Android TV and then load lots of applications which are not available in the official Google Play Store by default. The process itself is really easy and anyone can do it. You just need to follow my guide. So first of all, you have to get an app called Unloader. You can get it for free from the official Google Play Store. You just need to go to search on your device and start typing Downloader right here. Here we go, just type Downloader and click on that search button. And here it is, that's the application which we need to download. However, that's not it, we still have to set it up. To do so, we gotta to go to settings. So click on that gear icon right here, then click on the gear icon once again, go to system, then scroll down to about, then scroll down once again, and you have to select Android TV OS build. So make sure to select this option specifically, it has to be TV OS build and not TV OS version. So select the build. Now you have to click on the middle button on your remote for seven times and do it fast. So let's click. As you can see for me, there appears a message. No need, you are already a developer. For you, it's going to say that you have become a developer now. And if you go back a bit, the developer options are going to appear right here. So just go, go there and make sure that developer option toggle is turned to on. Now we did set up the downloader, but before actually using it, there's one more thing which I really recommend doing. It's of course connecting to a VPN. In my case, I mostly use NordVPN because they're super fast, they're not expensive, and they got a great app for Google TVs, Android TVs, Fire Sticks, laptops, TVs, phones, anything, you name it. So you just select any server here, let's say Cypress, but it does not really matter because each server has the same encryption level. And after you connect, your internet provider doesn't know what you're doing online. It doesn't know what movies you're watching, what apps you're downloading, and so on. And it really comes in handy to stay out of trouble online, especially with all those laws getting stricter and stricter. And if you want to get a VPN, or at least try it, you can use my promo link, which will be in the pinned comment below this video, if you use my link, you'll get four months of NordVPN totally for free, which is a great deal. So make sure to grab those four months, connect to VPN and stay safe. And now we are ready to use the loader. So let's open the loader application. And here in that search bar, we'll have to type a link, which you'll see on the screen in a moment. So here's the link which you need to enter, and then you gotta press on go. Make sure to enter the link exactly as you see, because otherwise it's not going to work. Then a website is going to open and you have to scroll down. Keep scrolling until you see that red APK time button. You gotta click on it, so click on that button. Then a new web page is going to open and you have to scroll down until you see that official website button. Click on it as well and then click on the APK time original link. Now we start downloading the app. Click on install. Here click on done and we have an option to delete the installation file because we don't need any more. So don't lock the memory of your TV with those unnecessary installation files. Click on delete and we are good to go. Now go to the list of apps in your device. Scroll down and here's the application which we just loaded. I'd recommend you to hold the middle button on your remote. Click on move and move it up. So this way the application is always going to be at the very front of your app list and it will be easier to access it. Then open the application. And here you'll find loads of different categories with hundreds of free applications. Some of the categories may be locked with codes. For example, the adult category is going to be locked and I'm not allowed you to show the codes in the video, but you can easily find the codes online or just ask in the comments and someone is going to reply to you. Not me, but I'm pretty sure someone is going to reply and tell you the code. Also, don't forget to use a VPN when loading something from the internet or via the APK time, just to make sure you stay out of trouble. And pretty much that's it. That's the easiest way to jailbreak your Android TV or Google TV or Chromecast in 2024. If the video was helpful, please click on the like button so more people would see it as well. And see you next time. Bye-bye.